Of course, this year is ending with kind of a ridiculous but sort of unforgettable story, the unforgettable feud between Rosie O'Donnell and Donald Trump. This thing started out ugly. It is only getting worse. And wait till you hear what the Donald had to say tonight about Rosie talking to Larry King on his private jet. We'll get to that in a moment. First, wanna, we really got to start at the beginning. I remember it well. It was earlier this week when Trump gave Miss USA a second chance. The next day, Rosie went off. She went to New York and she was hanging out at all the parties, doing what Paris and Lindsay do, you know, right. dancing, whatever. And so he held a press conference to <laughs> announce whether or not she was going to retain her crown. Yeah, and then yeah. she started to cry. She did. So like, I just want to thank Donald. He's giving me a second chance. And it's brilliant. And there he is, hair looping, going, everyone, everyone deserves a second chance. He's the moral authority. Left the first wife, had an affair. Left the second wife, had an affair. Had kids both times, but he's the moral compass for 20 year olds in America. Donald, sit and spin, my friend. Sit and spin? She lost me with sit and spin. Anyway, clearly, Rosie threw down the gauntlet. Trump, of course, being Trump, picked it up on one of those insider access ET phone home kind of shows. Take a look. Well, Rosie O'Donnell's disgusting. I mean, both inside and out. You take a look at her, she's a slob. You just called her a slob, but he's just getting warmed up. Go on. So probably I'll sue her because it would be fun. I'd like to take some money out of her fat ass pockets. What did he say? He keeps going. Keep, keep playing. I'll probably sue Rosie because she doesn't tell the facts. As an example, I'm worth many billions of dollars. Now, it's not that brag about. I'm worth many billions of dollars. It's very simple. She said I was bankrupt. She did say he was bankrupt. He's got that right. Let's keep going. Rosie is somebody out of control who really just doesn't have it. And she ought to be careful because I'll send one of my friends to pick up her girlfriend, and I think it would be very easy. Oh, no, he didn't. Did he just say that? He did? He did. All right, here's, here's what Rosie said today. Do the hair. Do the hair. Come on, do it, do it. I'm not doing it again. Do it, do it, do it. Hey, listen, it's a live show. You get me while I'm in the mood. And frankly, here's my comment to him. <laughs> mm, all right, here's what Donald said about the face thing. Well, Rosie's a loser. She's always been a loser. I've always understood it. She failed with her magazine. She failed with her show. As you know, at the end, it was doing very poorly in terms of the rating. Rosie is really somebody that she's unattractive in every sense of the word. From a physical standpoint, she looks like hell. Inside, she's far worse than she is on the outside. And I understand Rosie. But Rosie inherently is a loser. This thing just keeps going on and on. Here's what he said to, uh, to Larry King. The best thing Rosie has going is her girlfriend, Kelly. Now, if Kelly ever leaves Rosie, she'll never find another one, believe me. Because who's going to want Rosie? How would you like to have to kiss that good night, Larry? That would not yeah. be for you. Uh, Barbara Walters also chimed in today in a statement. She said, and I quote, I got to read this thing. Uh, Donald Trump is a personal friend of mine and has been a good friend to The View for many years. I'm sorry there's friction between Donald and Rosie. That said, I do not regret for one moment my choice to hire Rosie O'Donnell as the moderator of The View. I certainly hope and expect that this tempest will pass quickly. I hope so too. A quick ending, but. Mm, I don't think that's actually going to happen. Rosie and the Donald, they've got a record of picking fights with famous people. Up next, a look at their celebrity beefs. Are they for real or just publicity stunts? Gosh, what do you guys think, huh? Could this possibly just be a publicity stunt? Plus...